Halloween is fast approaching. It's such a fun and festive holiday for our ghost goblins and parents too. With all the excitement of trick-or-treating and the added sugar, of course, it's easy to overlook some basic manners. So let's get a little reminder here. Our very own etiquette expert, Nancy of Polished, is here to share some essential do's and don'ts for trick-or-treating to ensure that everyone has a spectacular time and you look fabulous. Well, I would wear my hat, but then you wouldn't be able to see me, so what the heck? <laughs> I'm having a spectacular time here. Well, let's start with the first reminder. Since you're in costume, let's yes. talk about costume etiquette and being costume ready. Right. You know, it's so important. First of all, like you said, everybody loves Halloween. It's all about getting that candy, that chocolate, or whatever that treat is. But at the same time, you want to be able to uh, have an, a happy experience. So as somebody who's giving out the candy, you know, avoid being in that scary, vampire-looking, bloody costume. Because the kids, those four-year-olds or, or younger might not understand that whole look, right? So, and conversely too, you know, be be appropriate. We don't want to have any costumes that are picking, fu making fun of anybody or doing anything in a mean-spirited mm -hmm. way. So just enjoy um, the, 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 the holiday itself and enjoy dressing up appropriately. I hear a lot of parents remind their kids when they're going door to door, just take one piece, just take one piece. Yes. What do you do as the homeowner if you have some kids come around and they're like ready to take a whole handful? How can you balance that respect but still be fun. Yes, yes. Well, gosh, I mean, who wouldn't want to take more than one piece right? when you have this big bowl of chocolate in front of you? But no, it's just enjoy. I think as the person delivering the candy, you can say, oh, happy Halloween, you know, enjoy a piece or two. And that sort of sets the guideline of mm -hmm. what is the expectation. It's okay to offer that yes, direction yes, right yes. away. And as a parent, don't, you know, remind your children to say thank you mm -hmm. uh, because this is a treat. You know, you're getting something that's, that's not necessarily owed to you, right? Right? Yeah. So thank you. This is very This kind. is a great time to practice those practice basic manners. Those manners, exactly. What are some other ways that we can show respect, including to the property that we're on? Okay, this is a big one because now I've noticed more and more homes are going crazy with decorations. Yeah. So there's skeletons, there's tombstones, there's bats, there's you know, you name it, they're out there. So use the sidewalk. Don't trample through and knock over flower pots or or a Halloween decoration or whatever it is. Just be mindful of the, you know. The, the property and, and take the sidewalk. One other thing that we want to mention to be mindful of is pets too. Pets, yes. You know, sometimes a dog's bark is bigger than its bite and that could be scary for a child when they're opening the door. So just put the dog in another room. I know Spot or Fido, they're good dogs, but you know, the four-year-old may not know that, right? Sure. So just be uh, be considerate with that. We also quickly talked about the lights being a clear and easy signal to say yes, yes, if you're open yes, or not. Yeah, it's a silent signal for homeowners to say, you know what, I want you to come to my door. The lights are on, the porch lights are on, the blinds are open, and the kids are ready. Now, some people are not into Halloween, so turn off the light. That, mm -hmm. again, is a silent signal. Or you can leave a, you know, a nice big sure. bowl of candy out and say, enjoy a sweet treat. Nancy, thank you for the reminders. Of Even course. a fun holiday can be a great opportunity I to know. practice. I have a fast joke. Sure, yeah. What is a, um, a ghost's favorite fruit? Oh, I know this. My kids have booberries. You're Did right. Did I get it? Yay! <laughs> that was my boy's go-to because we love blueberries. Yeah, you have to come with a joke. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, don't you love Halloween? It 